Oh, wow. That is, uh, <laughs> that is quite the greeting there. All of these people saying hello. All right. All right, everyone. Welcome back to a another video. Uh, we are on a very different server this time around. I saw this on, um, Box Blair is, I think, how you say his channel's name. And, uh, yeah, I was really, really intrigued by it. So obviously, you know, we have the beta series on our channel, uh, which we play the beta version of Minecraft and we build stuff that you guys recommend. But this server, this was something I really wanted to check out. I saw in his video that he had started uh, something on here. I'm not exactly sure what he was doing. I only tuned into it for about five to ten minutes. Um, so I can't really remember much of the video. It was a few days ago. Uh, but he was on here and he was walking around and I was like, you know what? I want to take a look at it. I want to walk around as well. So uh, I think I might play on this server quite a bit because this is pretty cool and I've never really had uh, anyone else to play the beta versions with. So um, this isn't actually on beta Minecraft. This is um, in the modern version. So it's using 1.21, but it has uh, a bunch of data packs and resource packs to turn the 1.21 into beta 1.7.3 as you can see by uh we have these leaves here i feel like we should turn that off for the sake of the video should i turn that off i should probably turn that off all right that seems to be uh much more beta minecraft to me okay so um obviously we don't have hunger we can't run i just tried uh sprinting that doesn't work so that's all accurate and i guess this is pretty much how it is uh, back then in the version. So I figured we should probably like walk around for a little bit and see what's going on. There was a rules page. I'm sorry. I did not really read it. I probably should have went back and read that, but I'm a, I'm a well-behaved Minecraft mushroom. So I won't be breaking anything or griefing anything. So, um, I assume those are usually what the rules are. We will uh, abide by the most typical server rules. I'm not sure what this is. This is a, Piano? Play by hand tunable piano. Oh, whoops. I think that's the key that it was on, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. I accidentally did that. I didn't mean to do that, but we fixed it. All right. Well, uh, okay. There's lots and lots of signs here. Let's check out some of these. Looks like these are all people that have been here before. Okay. They're all relatively recent. I think this server is quite new. I honestly have no idea though. That could be entirely wrong. Uh, let's head over to, the, to this bridge over here. This looks quite nice. I'm actually, I'm so concerned about, look at this here as well. Sorry for getting sidetracked. This is so cool. I feel like I should take a thumbnail right in here somewhere. Let's see if I can like, all right. Well, I was a little late on the actual, um, okay. We might need to revisit that later on. Okay, uh, well, what do these signs say over here? Nature area, do not build here. Interesting, I'd like to, this is just like overwhelming so far. There's so much going on. Um, I'm a little bit scared of the nighttime because I don't have anything at all. So I don't know where I get anything. I think this is just like an SMP. I mean, this is just Minecraft beta we've got a sand duplicator over here so definitely got our beta stuff just have a look at this though this is just like all over the place i love this little area right here this like seaside little town they got going on with uh what was that um these buildings right here this is really nice i would love to do something like that in my world um i would love to take another picture but it is unfortunately nighttime so it's a little hard to get uh, a good photo at the moment. Let's walk over here. Well, uh, we're waiting for it to turn day again. There's a zombie over there. Uh, my zoom mod isn't working right. Yes, it is not. Okay. Uh, sand duplicator. Okay. That's the second sign we've seen for that. We've got a sugarcane farm over here. Uh, I don't want to break anything, uh, just yet. Underton's house. I don't know if I'm allowed to enter these houses or not. Um, okay, we've got a shop here. This is good to know. Looks like, uh, they've had some trouble refilling <laughs> some of the stuff. All right, I'm not, well, this is obviously the spawn, so I'm aware that I am at the spawn, but I'm not sure if there's, like, districts in the spawn. I'm just walking over the, uh, walking over this person's roof here. Uh, let's see if I can get down more safely. We'll follow this path. 
off to this direction over here. Looks like we've got two players over here. 15, River Haven. Okay, so this is where the this thing is. Attending to their usual uh, building task. We got three guys over here. So uh, there's quite a few people working on River Haven over here. I do like this building as well. Oh, well, look at that. Hello, sir. How's it going? I think he was just telling me that if I need wheat, I can use it. Um, so we might, we might come back. Uh, anyways. Okay. Let's keep walking. All right. Over here. What is this over here? This is, wow. Look at this area. This is pretty cool. Oh, that's not ideal. Okay. Um, I like, I like this bridge. Am I allowed to just go in these? I guess I can just go in these. I would love to, uh, walk across this bridge here. If I can find my way, I think over. Nope. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm a little bit lost. This, okay. It looks like we need to get up there somehow. So probably up here would be my guess. There we go. All right. How far does this keep going on for it? Looks like this is just about it over here. I think this concludes most of the spawn. We didn't really go over that way. Uh, let's see here. There is wheat over here. Perhaps I should grab just a few. I will, of course, replant this. Just in case we need it. Oh, I forgot. We are in the, uh... The beta versions of Minecraft. I can't really walk over the crops. I've got to, uh... Whatever. I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I messed up a, a few of your guys' blocks. I didn't mean to. Oh, look at this. This is more... Moon glow style over here, this type of building. This would be pretty cool to check out. So I say we go and have a look over here. Put fences under crops. Yep, that's the typical beta trick right there. All right, and we can go ahead and turn this into bread. Oh, <laughs> well, I should have seen that one coming. I forgot. Oh, yes, food obviously does not stack in this version. Uh, how could I have overlooked that? Uh, probably not the smartest idea to be carrying 32 pieces of bread on me. Um, all right, I don't think we checked out any of that over there. That bridge looks quite interesting. I would love to go over there and have a look at that. Even the anti-aliasing is like the old school versions where it's super pixelated and stuff. That's pretty cool. Walk over this direction somehow. Walk down here. The chat is very lively. Lots of people chatting about, which you love to see. Always nice to have that um, stuff in here. You know what I just love about this server is how friendly it seems. Everybody seems to be having a good time. Everybody's just hanging out. They're just playing Minecraft, and you love to see that stuff. So, um, yeah, I could definitely see myself coming back on here and starting a little series here on the channel, but I did want to just like walk around first and figure out where everything was before we did that. So that's probably mostly what this episode is going to be. You're probably going to see a lot of me just walking around and trying to figure out where exactly I am because I'm not so sure I know where I am. <laughs> I know I'm at the spawn and I think we spawned over in that direction. I would love to actually take a picture of the spawn again and it is becoming the morning so i think that is what we are going to do there is a dog sitting in this intersection hello sir um okay i like this building here too this clock tower i would love to see if i could get a better um vantage point for a picture here so we can take a thumbnail this building's quite nice it reminds me of the european city in my spawn world all right, I feel like that was uh, a few good pictures walking around on this super low FOV. Uh, I, I would like to actually play with a little bit lower FOV than uh, normal because that's kind of giving it that old school Minecraft feel. This is the nether portal here. All right, so this just looks like a bunch of directions. <laughs> this is, <laughs> we all know what this is right here. We've all tried that at least once in our lives. Um, we didn't really go over this way, though. Uh, I should probably turn this up a little bit. Um, we'll see what's going on over here. And then uh, I guess, I don't know. I guess we could uh, we could probably go over there, too. <laughs> Sorry if I'm a little scatterbrained. Um, 
All right, I am a little scatterbrained right now. I can't really decide where I want to go yet, so I guess I will just let my keyboard do the talking. I will hold down W and see where we end up. This is very, very flat over here. Look at this. This just, like, totally transformed. There is so much more here than I thought. Um, look at this building over here. This is very cool looking in this Italian building. Oh, that's quite interesting. I've never seen that done in beta before. So they used furnaces as pillar points on the building. That is really, really unique. That is, that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. All right. I'm not sure what's uh, beta link, beta link. Is that the name of this town? Let's see if we can find a, a better... Look at this place, man. Wow, this is so cool. I feel like I've just completely teleported back to 2011 again when I first started playing. This is just like <laughs> so awesome. I'm blown away by a, a lot of the stuff that I'm seeing on here. So, so cool. I never even noticed that the helicopter as well. Isn't that something? The die shop. This axe inside of a tree. I'm sure that must be some sort of wood shop or something. Okay, we've got an alleyway here that goes different directions. Let's try to head more towards the city center. Got all sorts of stuff over here. This is really, really, really cool. Props to everyone that has put their uh, time and effort into building this. I am truly blown away. Uh, I didn't get the chance to actually fully watch um, Blair's video on this server, so I didn't really get to see all that much until now. Uh, obviously seeing it for myself and on my own computer just how cool it actually is there's so much stuff here i'm really uh really really blown away by this i think this is super cool so um i think we will start our own little base here on this server and uh, we'll see how it goes we got all sorts of <laughs> buildings overhanging on the cliffs over there and such man yeah beta 1.7.3 that was just a different period of time for the game it was very very unique i'd have to say um in my opinion i really do love modern minecraft i really enjoy it i think it's super cool it's very artistic um very free and uh it feels like you can kind of just build whatever comes to your mind because you have so many different things to choose from so it feels a lot like drawing and painting where this version was so simplified that you really, really had to use your creative um, direction for things because you just had so limited palettes to choose from. And you can see that in all of these buildings. They've all, there's only like 150 blocks in the game at this stage. And you can see how everyone has used all these different types of blocks to um, create these different shapes with such a simplified palette. And that's just that beta feel that you can't replicate in modern versions. And um, yeah, I just, I think that's super cool. Um, I've always been intrigued by that. And just the way everything looks, how the grasses, the biomes, all that, it, it brings back a lot of memories for me of when I used to play this version after school, when I was uh, 12, 13 years old, which believe it or not was uh, almost um, <laughs> probably 12, 13 years ago at this point. So it is cool to uh, reminisce on that stuff and whatnot so uh what is over here i don't believe we walked over here it seems like we're starting to get to the outskirts of the spawn cities and whatnot so i will have to uh take a look at uh, what is over here very shortly it doesn't look like there's much so i think we have just about reached the edge of where most of the stuff is so i am going to backtrack all the way back <laughs> to the spawn again and uh we are gonna go walk over that way <laughs> look at this device here what is this binary encoded machine holy cow some sort of serious thing going on over here all of the signs were labeled and whatnot and <laughs> Wow, yeah, this is uh, some sort of serious machine right here. Look at this thing. That is absolutely ridiculous. I have no idea what it does, but it clearly does something very important. Digitalize. Is it a computer? Interesting. 
Well, if any of you know what this is in the comments, please be sure to let me know because that is quite the uh, design right there. Crazy. All right, it seems I was correct. There is more stuff over here. Just have a look at this. There is so much going on. <laughs> I absolutely love it. It just reminds me of way back in the day when I used to play this game all the time. Just logging onto servers and seeing stuff all pillared throughout the sky and whatnot. I mean, you just, you can't really replicate this feel these days with all the classic blocks and stuff. So it is uh, very nice to see. And, um, yeah, look at this. There's so much more over here. So we will tour this little section and then I think we'll call it the end of today's video. I would like to uh, log back on and start my own base uh, somewhere on here. So that'll be part number two, uh, starting that. And I think it'll be a lot of fun to uh, mess around with that for a few months or so. Um, and we'll see what we can come up with in the beta versions. Of course, um, just kind of taking a bit of a break from the... Um, you know, modern versions of Minecraft. Obviously, I have the single player world and I spent so much time on there building so many things that uh, I really, really had to take a break. So that's why you've seen uh, a lot of... Uh, that's why you've seen the pace of the videos slow down a lot um, because I just honestly was feeling pretty burnt out <laughs> from playing on that world. I spent so many hours, way more than what made it into videos. We've got a giant ship over here as well. Oh, look at those buildings. Those are going to be cool. That is not cool. That is also not cool. Okay, let's just see if we can maneuver our way around here. It looks like we can go up and over the hill. So that is exactly what I will do. And hopefully we don't get... We could tour. How do I even get down? How did I end up in this situation? <laughs> that is what I am wondering. What is that over there? Holy... This is so freaking cool, man. Okay, we've got a nice little bench here, and I'm sure we can just right over here. Okay, that's nice. Okay, so we've got empty plots. Look at this. The, I'm assuming this is the church over here. Yes, it is. Church of the Holy Pug. Oh, boy. And we got a milk bucket in there. We'll leave that in there. We've got lots of signs here as well, <laughs> who the church is dedicated to. So if you see your name on there uh hello hello anyways all right we got this fountain over here very nice i love this little alleyway right here this is really cool so um this is where we are relative to the church so this is what the church looks like inside and then we've got this beautiful little path over here that splits into two directions in this awesome alleyway with this sand castle structure in the background and the giant tree over there this is just so cool man I am like freaking out right now. I, I just feel <laughs> like I am literally back in 2011. I know I've said that a few times now, but I just can't uh, emphasize enough how awesome it is to feel that nostalgic feeling again. It's very, very difficult to get that these days, especially even on my beta world. Like that still doesn't feel like 2011 to me, but this does. And I would love to applaud the uh, owners of the server and everyone that uh, plays on it frequently uh, for being able to replicate that feeling because that is not an easy thing to do. Look at all this stuff over here though. This is just like an overload of classic buildings. So cool. Uh, but we have to make our way over that direction there to the west. So I will cut in a minute once things start to show in view again. All right, we made it to the other side. We got some sort of building over here. That is the other side of the sandcastle and that giant tree. Uh, I would love to check out what was over there, but we got quite the um, <laughs> obstacles to <laughs> maneuver around over here. We're going to have to go beta swimming. It's much better than I thought it was. I could only just barely see it from a distance. It looks super, super cool, though. Oh, boy. Okay, we just had the... Uh, Turnaround of the century there with that uh, daylight switch. Look at this. Wow, there's some sort of other structure behind it as well. All right. Uh, we will check this out and then we'll wrap it up for today. I am so impressed with this build over here. This is um, really, really nicely put together as well as this one here too. Isn't that something? I really like these. This is kind of like um, 
I don't know, it reminds me of myself, these builds. Uh, this is exactly how I would design something if I were building in the beta versions. I don't often work with circular stuff though, um, but it is really, really super cool. So I think uh, I'd probably find um, some area over here to build by. I don't want to be too far away from spawn. Look at the size of this one over here as well. Uh, I guess we could uh, have probably, I know some of you guys are probably screaming at the screen for me to head inside of here, so I will. I will check out the inside of this place. Hopefully there's a sign we can see who built this thing. But look at this. This is a crazy, crazy build. There's more stuff over there as well. See if there's any sign on the front of who built this. Eh, it doesn't look like it over here, maybe. Uh, not quite. Some sort of system under here not sure what that means and a rail track to westville so this looks like the train station this is where you get up look at this this is just awesome i am blown away from this one 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 beta minecraft build right there really really nicely done uh, i would love to head over to that sandstone one that was over there if i could scale this uh small hill i thought that this was just that one spawn area that we were at but there is so much more over here this whole place is just filled with buildings like every direction i look it's just more and more stuff uh can we make that place your bets in the comments oh not quite maybe another time let's see what's going on over on this side i wanted to get a picture of some of these buildings right here together nah not quite it is a really really cool building though this one's got a uh, really interesting shape to it with this extension off of the side and this sideways bridge i am just totally blown away by the uh not only the amount of buildings but the quality of the buildings as well. So many of them are really, really nicely done. I'm seriously, seriously impressed. Some sort of church back there as well. I mean, this is just so freaking cool. I would love to head over. Uh, there was one last building I wanted to check out over there. And uh, we will call it wraps for today. Uh, we'll spend the next episode figuring out where we are going to build our stuff and maybe we'll get something started but i think uh this is pretty much it for the episode i did want to check out that one uh building that's just over the hill there looks like this might still be in construction i can't tell it's got an open top and here we go this is what i was talking about this small little village over here isn't that cool with the uh the church bell and stuff and this nice little uh pier and whatnot just really really impressed by the quality of work here today uh, lots of great beta builders on this server oh that is a great picture if i can get all of these in the same photo i think that'll be my thumbnail look at this town as well this is very beta feeling too very nicely done i love this cathedral as well this is like my video of uh <laughs> the land where souls rest this is like if you were to take that build and build it in beta it would look exactly like that <laughs> which is quite funny yeah i really like this build this is pretty cool this is pretty cool here seems like it's just a uh, regular cathedral on the inside there which is nice but yeah i think that's about it for today's video i had such a blast uh, filming here today. There were so many cool things to check out and uh, I've definitely got some inspiration for um, my bases now. So uh, if you guys haven't already, please be sure to like and subscribe and all of that stuff. I know I don't ask that often, um, but it does really help out the channel. That's why uh, these YouTubers say that is because uh, it just helps push out our videos to other people and helps the channel grow. If you'd like to see more on the modern beta server, please be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel. We will be doing more so that way you can uh, stay updated with what we've got going on. But as for today, I think that's about wraps. I'm going to go ahead and log off here. Thank you guys so much. I'll catch you guys in the next video. See you later.